Hey, listen, I'm sorry about being weird back there. It's just, well, oh, there's something I need to tell you. Whew, this is this is hard. Just give me a second. Oh, you got this, Kenny. Come on. What are you doing? You're making it awkward. All right, Kenny, you're talking to yourself now. They can hear you. It's not so hard. Just tell them everything. Thank you. Thank you for that. You have ruined our public image. <laughs> you, you'd never judge me, right? I mean, we're such close partners hey, at this point, you know? You like, nothing I could say could ruin that, right? <laughs> I'm just just kidding around. Just I'm just joking around. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm out of my body right now, I think. Broken leg guy's still here. See you later. Boy, okay, so that um, that dying Gatlian that we saved, let's do it. Let's say we can fix him up and he, you know, back alive. The thing is, oh, okay, sorry, sorry. I, I'm just trying to figure out how to say this properly, or, or you know, like communicate um, the, how we normally do, right? You know, the Gatlian we saved, let's do it. Uh, he knows some things about me that 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 the others don't know, and it's, it's, it's nothing too crazy, you know. It's, it's okay, no, it's it's bad. It's really bad. Sorry, I don't mean to be cryptic. I'm just, oh, this is tough. You know, this is really hard. I, I just don't want you to hate me. I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Twig is working today? Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Oh, uh, actually, we're wondering if someone named Tweeg is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. We, 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 will, we will take a table. Enjoy your meal. Your waiter will be with you shortly. Thank you. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Applebee's. I know we're really focused on Lizzie, and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first? Whew, okay, thanks. You know, it's just, you know, it it's going to weigh me down if I don't say something. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. Y y you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry, of course you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? <sighs> okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm gonna be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Okay, sure thing. I'm gonna go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. Okay, bounty hunter, so l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But, you know, I, I wanted out. Like, I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. 
Great, it's coming right up. Oh, uh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Okay, oh, right, um, obviously a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and, well, you know, that led us to the G3, and Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower, and, well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know, I, I really do, but at the time, I couldn't tell, you know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You no, know, everyone thought I was a fuck up. You know, I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something. You know. Open up. Here comes the appetizer train. Chicka 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 choo choo. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. You betcha. I'm gonna get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. So. I led the G3 right to Gatlas. Do you see where I'm going with this? We fought them off at first, you know, but they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Let's Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Let's Do It survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do you, do you see my problem, right? Like, I, I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, someone's feeling grumpy. Oh, wonderful. Now, w what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Oh, hey, Tweak's doing a whole kidnapping cliche, I guess. Why the hell are you even doing this? Uh, money, duh! I'm selling you out to the G3. I told them where you all were and they gave me money for, um, for doing that. Now I'm bringing you to them for even more money! <laughs> Come on, that's shitty. Let me go! No, are you out of your fucking mind? This is a kidnapping. Jesus Christ, not to be, you know, cliche, but we, oh shit, we gotta yeah. save her. We can't dine and dash. I love this place, don't wanna get blacklisted. Oh fuck, okay, this, this, this changes shit, this is bad. I'm here live in downtown Grim City where, as you can see, we've been invaded by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter. <laughs> ah, okay. Well, there you have it. It looks like this is only a problem if you are that bounty hunter that they're trying to kill. I'm People Fuckerton, Blim City News. Stay safe out there. Could be in danger. Come on, come on, keep up the pace. We, we, we have to get back to the house. That's right, let's go. We're gonna hurry. Oh, yeah, I've been here the whole time, but, but don't worry, I'll keep your secret safe. I'm, I'm not a snitch. Hey, what's going on, guys, buddy? 
Close. I may be 230, but I don't want to die yet. Are we? Did did we make it? Yeah, we're safe. Nobody on our tail. But uh, where are we? Am I missing something? I'm not picking up any signs of life out there. Then we're in the right spot. Kenny, where did you just take us? It was the only safe place I could think of. Careful, it's toxic out there. I set up an atmosphere bubble so you can breathe. So don't wander too far, or do. What does it matter anymore? Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3, bitch. Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? Fine, I don't need an answer. God, yes, creature. It, it was our home, and it got all fucked up. We're, we're, we're trying not to think about it too much. Got it. Thank you. Well, it looks like shit. How is it out there? We, we, we don't want to talk about it. That bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. We still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? You know what, kid? Maybe you should get some rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. Head on upstairs. I'll take care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Gene's right. Let's get some shut-eye. We'll make this right starting tomorrow. He's probably still shacked up with that oriental chick. Well, the least he could have done is brought her to the brink. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? Y you have to tell me. Like, seriously, come on. We're best friends now. All right, good night. All I had was a week. A better week. All right, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. By the way, I got you a little something-something. 
A new suit upgrade. Extra overshield. You're welcome. Let's get to business. I've got something you like. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. Oh, that's great. So, so she's... She's alive. Don't worry. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. Oh my god! Hey. What the fuck happened here? Are, are you okay? I'm fine. I... I took care of things. You mean you killed Twig? I took care of it. Thanks for picking me up. We good here? Uh. Cool. I am sick of this cramped RV. All right. Uh, can, can we just let's head back through the portal? You just, just follow us. Hey, you know something? I really appreciate you coming to get me. Of course, Lizzie. I mean, you, you, you're part of the team. You know, we, we wouldn't we wouldn't be anything without you. You know, you, you know your your little wiseacre quips and your your whole weird little side story thing that you did. I don't even you know. But yeah, you're you you're important. Stop patronizing me. Okay. Yep. Yep. Sorry. No. I I will. I'm gonna work on that. I'm still growing as a Gatlian. I'm not perfect. Can can we just go? Can we just get out of this Clive Barker fucking bloodbath hole? fucking tunnel we're in? Can we just go? Yeah, let's. We're back. You're safe. Uh, I mean, fuck you. And a fuck you, too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Clug just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's gotta be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're gonna be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. Y you're serious? That, that, that soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's gonna be just fine. Old Papa Jean watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's, that's, that's great. It's, it's just... What? You don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy? Fuck. Whew, okay. I guess it's now or never, Bounty Hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? Hey everybody, I, I I need to come clean about, uh, well, sh this is f way tougher than I thought. Spit it out! Yeah, spit it out! No, I I, I can't, I, you, you're gonna hate me. Dad, th we, we don't have secrets. We're a family! Well, hold on, I might decide to hate him. It's okay, Kenny, you can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine, if you don't hear it from me, you're just gonna hear it from Les Dewitt when he wakes up. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'll be mad. I, I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... Fuck, he's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. How can it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But, but how could that be possible? We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere, and, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing, and, but then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Les Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I didn't know he, I didn't know he was gonna survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have to tell us the truth. No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, this is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. 
Let's just... Oh, okay, let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure, easy, done. What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on, that, 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 that's not fair. Don't fight. I'm sure we can all figure this out. No, creature. He can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same. I, I'm sorry. Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nippulon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals. You're bounty hunters. Act like it. Mm -hmm. Fine. Huh. Okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tureen, so we got a strike now. Can you handle that? Let's just get this over with. Well, the least he could have done is brought us to the brig to cheer us up a little. We were only in there a week. He's not gonna let Hey, in the event that I manage to get Lizdwit back online, we'll be ready to fight Garmantuous. And for that, you're really gonna need those Earth coordinates. Nipulon should have them logged somewhere in his office, in that big drug lounge he runs. Find those if you can. So we can take the fight to Garmantuous back on your home planet and finish this. Okay, we just need to sneak into Nipulon's lounge. Let's try... Can it, traitor! We'll handle this one. We don't want you selling us out. Kenny, do us all a favor and sit this one out. Hey, stop fighting! I hate it when everyone's fighting! We need to talk things over in a healthy way. No, 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 no. We just need to cover ourselves in goop again. It's not complicated. That's true. We should do that. But I also think we need to have a really fun time at the saloon. So go there first, please. Uh, whatever. It's, it's up to you, Bounty Hunter. Head over to Drake County and get up or try hacking us out of the saloon. bad I feel about this whole Gatlas thing? I know they can hear me right now. I know that's sort of the rule, rules we set up, but still, don't they know? Oh, you're going with my plan? It's an honor. I will not take this lightly. Shall we take a seat at an open table? Okay, creature, this was your big idea. What is there to even talk about? Thank you, everyone, for coming today to the inaugural Big Friendship Meeting. First item on the agenda is... You don't have to do this, creature. No, no, I insist. Kenny doesn't deserve any of this hate, right, Bounty Hunter? Well, thank you, but I, I, don't, I don't know if that's true. Yeah, you didn't know what you were doing. Just because he's an idiot doesn't mean he gets off scot-free. Yeah, people died. We don't have a home anymore. No, no, stop it! I mean... Let's be civil here. We're friends. Are we? Most of my friends don't trigger global genocides. Well, I don't know if that's the best way to phrase it. Oh, yeah? How would you phrase it then? Lightly assisting a global genocide? I didn't know. I, I didn't know what would happen. Oh, fuck off. Like, that makes it any better. But he's also trying to stop it. He's trying to make things right. We all are. It's not, not like he has much choice. You think he's doing this because it's the right thing to do, Bounty Hunter? Thank you, Bounty Hunter. At least you have my back. I have your back too, Kenny. Yeah, thanks, Creature. Yeah, but we don't. Yeah, we still hate you, Kenny. Creature, this isn't getting us anywhere. No, it's going perfectly. It has to be going perfectly, otherwise I'll be sad. Then be sad, Creature. Tough shit. You could just blame Kenny if you want, like we're doing. It's pretty easy. Can we just bail on this little group therapy session we got going on here and get back to the bounty, which is more important? Honestly, I'm right there with you. you know, th th this, is, this is a lost cause. No. No, it's not a lost cause. Is it, Bounty Hunter? Yes, we will. Uh, look, look, fine. Maybe. Maybe. But let's just deal with Nippelon first, okay? Can we do that? Whatever. Are we done here? Can we go, Bounty Hunter? Well, that was pretty pointless. Hey, 
It's me, the good guy. I'm over here now. I moved here for your convenience. It's closer. Hey, look who it is. It's the goop salesman. Hey, hey we are here for your services. We would like to get gooped again, if you if, if you could. Oh, no can do, partner. See, my little gooper trooper here is sick as can be. Looks like he's not going to make it. Truth be told, I don't think he'll ever be gooping anybody ever again. Unless we get him that medicine. Medicine? Well, maybe we can help. Oh, no way. Thank you so much. Wow, that's so nice of you. There's a special flower over there on uh, the other side of Terrine Ravine. But good luck getting over there, because that ravine is tearing through the valley, if you know what I mean. Those damn mac and cheese brothers are taking forever to build the bridge. I mean, if you could get them to do their jobs, then maybe we could get the flower and save my little goopa. Don't worry, we, we, we got it. We could do it. Well, shit. I don't want to get my hopes up, but thank you so much. Hey, you want to see my Kenny impression? Huh? Um, um, can, can, can you stop by the G3 headquarters real quick so so I can sell out all my friends? Gosh, Kenny's still our friend. No, it's fine. Let him go nuts. Wait, I can do one too. Oh, uh, nobody loves me and I suck. Uh, I'm a piece of shit. A big dumb sicko who loves getting everyone killed. Well, here's mine. Well, my name's Kenny. Uh, oh, I'm sorry for what I did. I, I love you all very much and I'll, I'll never do anything bad again, ever. Great work, everybody. I hope you, I hope you got it all out of your system. We could build some windows out here, you know? I know we're trying to build a bridge, but it's like, fuck, man. How you build a bridge with... Hey, 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 whoa, whoa, Buster. What are you doing walking on? This is a live construction site. Very dangerous. You can't hang around here unless you're a construction professional like one of us mac and cheese brothers are. Okay, so you're not leaving, are you? You're just fucking barging in. What do you want from us? Hey, we're, we're just trying to look for a way across. Well, tough luck. You, you, you think you own the world? You want to get across the ravine? You got to wait for us mac and cheese brothers brothers to do our work. Yeah. Yep. Come on, you're telling me there's nothing we can do. No, sorry, pal. Listen. We got our own emotional shit right now. You know, we're, we're on strike until Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers, you know, he comes back from that goddamn saloon in Old Town and he tells us he loves us Mac and Cheese Brothers, his sons. You, you want us to get your dad to love you? All right, listen, we just need to hear that he loves us. That's it. We ain't working until we find out, okay? Hey, we're the Mac and Cheese Brothers. Yeah, you can't do shit. You're, you're a piece of shit. Fuck you. <laughs> you fucking piece of Uh, sorry, does anyone know where we can find, uh, Papa Mac and Cheese? Hello, I'm sorry, we're trying to find a Papa Mac and Cheese. You might, may, may be able to point us in the right direction? Hey, you there. Yeah? I'll tell you what Papa Mac and Cheese is, if you do this guy. What? No, no, I mean, please pick anybody but me, please. Huh? A duel? Okay, okay. Well, you know what, listen, whatever, we'll do it. You know the rules. Stand five feet apart, count to three, then draw. Last man standing wins the fucking duel. Come on, man. I, I don't want to do this. Come on, it'll be fucking fun. Go on, then. Get to your mark. What's the matter with you? You gotta stand on your fucking mark at a fucking door cat. Perfect! Here we go then. Jeez. I'll count you down. Shoot at each other on fucking draw, alright? Great. Alright, we got this. Two. I believe in you. I think. One. Fucking draw. Whoa. That's some quick trigger finger you got there, fuckface. Oh, th thank you. Is he, is he gonna be okay? Oh, yeah, he's dead. But it's fine. We hated him. He's a fucking piece of shit. Anyway, sorry about all that. I was just fucking with you. It's fun to do a whole Big Ten shootout thing, you know? Yeah, we love it. Anyway, I'm Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers. What can I do you for? Oh, uh, we met your kids over at the construction site. Oh, is that so? Yeah. And how are those good-for-nothing pieces of shit doing? They just sent us here to get the confirmation that you love them. That's it. But I hate them. They're shit heels. They ain't fit for the Mac and Cheese Brothers' name. Wait, are you... What? Are, you, you don't really want us to tell them that. Yeah. Tell them I said I hate them, and I hope they all fucking die. Now leave me the fuck alone. Uh, okay. I guess that's that then. You are... You're a tough guy, Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers. Oh, look who's back. 
Hey, so what, what, what did Papa say? Huh? Does he love us or not? Your dad, um, he loves you very much. Holy shit, did he, did he really say that? Yes, he did. Oh my god, I'm, oh my god, I'm freaking out, you guys. He, he fucking loves us, you hear that? He, uh, Papa, Papa loves us. God, I can't handle whatever I'm feeling. It is, it is, what is, 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 is this love? Is this what love is? Oh god, I, I yeah. can't handle whatever this feeling is. Is this, oh my god, is, is this love? See, uh, Jesus, these guys need therapy. Oh. But hey, looks like we can cross now, though. <laughs> fucking bridge of love. All right, we did it. Let's get this back to the goop salesman and fix up his gooper. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, I know. You're back. Oh, we did it. Who oh, knew we you, could just later. make a bridge with love? You're telling me? Sorry if I'm a little distracted. I, I, I've, I've got a lot on my mind. You know, like all my friends blaming me for genocide. my little Goopa's life. Thank you so much. It was no problem. But actually, no, it was it was really tough. Uh, but you're welcome, you know? Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh my god. As good as new. You really saved his life. I don't know how I could ever repay you. Oh, that's right. He could shit his Goopa all over you. Wow, you healed him up so nice, his goop's gonna last even longer than before! So you're gonna be covered in shit for such a long time! That's great! Ugh, all this fucking work just to get covered in this shit again. Wow, you look great! Real goopy, real shitty. Oh shit, okay, G3, don't forget, we're in disguise, we don't have to fight! Gooped G3 Minion. You must be here for your one free spa day. Please enjoy your stay. It's working. Hello, esteemed G3 Minion. Thank you for redeeming your one time only free spa day. Please continue forward. Oh, uh, oh, thank you. Okay, this is going well. Just gotta keep our cool and sneak our way through.
Ah, a guest. Please allow me to show you to a private booth. Right this way. Let's just play along. They might lead us right to Nipulon. We do hope you'll find your time here satisfactory. Remember, we're here to cater to your every need. You name a drug, we have it. Zero G, Fergals, and yes, we're now serving every type of human. We've got young teenagers if you're looking for something big, or perhaps you'll prefer the gentle high of an elder human years away from death. If you're not sure, babies are a little more heady. It's less of a body high. Basically, whatever you're looking for, we've got it. Please, don't stray. Come on. There will be plenty of time to relax once we get you set up with a nice batch of humans. Humans, ooh, humans, they're good. Ah, the main atrium. You can see how much of a good time everyone is having. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your booth is just past here. Holy shit! Hey, you gotta try this human shit. These dumb fuckers get you so high. I had a baby one a couple hours ago, but I swear I can't even remember my own name right now. God, I wish they lasted a little longer. You can suck these humans dry way too fast. But they hit so good. Waiter, bring me six more humans. More babies if you got them. I like them best young and innocent. And now, <laughs> please follow me to your booth. Hey, waiter, can I get a few more humans when I get a chance? Of course, sir. I hope you don't mind sharing your booth with another guest. We're a bit overbooked today. Sorry. Yeah, you ever try human? This shit's amazing. Oh, yeah. Look how dumb they look. All hairy and weak. You're lucky they gave you so fucking high. Otherwise, they'd be a waste of the species. Oh, fuck. I love seeing the light leave their eyes. Yeah, fuck this. Do what you have to do. What's wrong? Oh, what the fuck? Get out of there! Alright, we're doing this! Fuck, okay, we're in it now. We just have to push through to Nipulon.
shit, my heart is racing. the G3. Everyone else can just fuck off. depressing. impression isn't mean it's it's actually kind of sweet I hope you're still on my side bounty hunter BH. <laughs> I won't. Nippulon will see you shortly. Just, you know, can I get you anything? Helen, well, what are you doing here? Yep, you keep killing all my bosses, so I have to keep finding new ones to work for. <laughs> Why don't you take a seat for a moment? Whew, good idea. Let's rest those legs. We got, we got something coming up here. So, uh, how much longer do we have to wait? Any minute now. We appreciate your patience, thoughts, and prayers. 
Hey, Kenny, you want to skip the boss fight and just give ourselves up to Nipulon? Let him kill your friends for old time's sake? Great, just what I needed. Some more time to sit and feel like shit. Uh, uh, you do understand why we're mad at you, right? Yeah, no shit, and, and, and I'm sorry. You don't think I'm sorry? Guys, not in front of Helen. Oh, don't mind me. <laughs> I love overhearing stuff. I call it the Erie Canal. <laughs> I'm on the... <laughs> I don't know what I need to do to prove myself to everyone, but I'm sorry for my part in how things played out. I suffered too. I'm still suffering. Ugh, save the waterworks. Let's just stop the G3, and then we'll never have to see each other again. No holidays, no celebrations, no birthdays, no anniversaries, nothing. That's not what we want. It's what I want. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Understood. Okay, Nipulon will see you now. Well, look who it is! The Big Bad Bounty Hunter! Finally paying me a visit. You don't get it, do you? You feel like you're the king. kicking in. Have fun. Well, uh, I don't feel so good. Hey, kid, it's me, Normal Gene. Nothing weird or freaky going on. Come on, I've been meaning to ask you. Why are you doing all this? Don't you get it, kid? There's no hope for you. You're gonna end up just like me. Probably gonna lose your legs, too. I used to be something. Now look at me. Don't fool yourself, kid. This is your future. You're just Gene 2.0, and you're going straight down the drain like I did. You know that ain't true, kid. Look at me. No legs, no home, only two working eyes. And I, I mean, I guess you only got two eyes yourself, but that, that, that's not the point. This is your future. I thought I was invincible. Bounty hunter. Sounds like such a cool job. But really, you're just a glorified garbage man working freelance to take out the trash for anyone willing to pay. Risking your body. For what, kid? So you can lose your legs and find yourself all alone with no one to help you pick up the pieces because you killed everyone you ever met? Does that sound good to you? Maybe. Sure. Fine. That's a good point. Okay, you got me there. You conquered this part of your drug trip. Good work. All right. Go make sure you save the world, and then if you suffer, it'll be fine. I guess. Is that the uh, moral here? All right, see you later, kid. I think we need to go deeper. So let me get this straight. Your mad humans are just drugs to be shipped around and sold off? Well, that's how things work, moron! It's a circle of life! We're just making the best of it. Be mad at evolution, not us! Yep, it's me again. A whole lot of me. There's so many of them. Which one of them is real? Hey there, sleepyhead. Having a good trip. How do you buy it? Don't worry. I'll kill you before it gets too bad. Uh, ah, stop! All right. Let's see how many hours you logged in Fortnite or uh, Minecraft. Do you play those games? <laughs> <laughs> I go mental state, but I can't actually access your play data. Uh, let's just say you played 90 hours of Rocket League. Wow. Quite the uh, uh, sports fanatic, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, which one's the real me? 
Does one of me move a little differently or something? Does one of me slightly discolored? There's no way to know! How will you figure it out? It's missing. Hey, can we hurry up and get this over with? I'm a busy guy. Oh, you got me. Big deal. Let's say you tackle another round of combat with your inner demons. Oh, oh, since Lizzie's here. Hey, idiot. You need to come talk to me, or Mom. Do you really think you're doing this to save humanity? You do realize you're just playing the hero, right? Everyone else is dying, but you get to run around space with your little toys, pretending to be the savior of the universe. You're not a hero. You're selfish. This is all about you. Oh, sure, and you think you're the only one who can do that. You think they don't have, like, space institutions in place to deal with villains like the G3 cartel? I'm actually asking. I have no idea. I barely know anything about space. It doesn't matter. The point is, this is all about you. You didn't do anything with your life, and now you want to play pretend hero. Well, guess what? It might actually be working. I mean, I don't know anyone else who's doing anything to stop the G3. This might actually be... It might be the right thing for you to do. Oh my god. You! You really are humanity's only hope, aren't you? Fuck. Another hole. What, what is this? The, the, the hit indie game Donut County? Which I highly recommend if you're playing this right now. But, you know, let me pick it up. It's, only, it's sometimes on sale. motivation to keep going. How about an award? Here, take this one that says you spent all your in-game playtime at an alien strip club. Oh, that's permanent, by the way. Everyone on your friends list can see that forever now. How are you holding up? Facing some dark truths? Maybe things are a little confusing? Well, I'll make it clear for you. You're our product! And I'm helping you learn your place. More nebulons than they're everywhere. <laughs> what? Hey, here's a hack for you. Switch to the other controller port and you won't be able to hurt me. <laughs> Just kidding. There aren't any controller ports anymore. Let's go. I hope you like living in Greenland. <laughs> hey, now you're having some kind of fun to make you change your mind. I'm not so bad. You can see my... Was that even the real me? God, you're really having a rough go of it. How much longer can you hold on to your sanity? Looks like you're having enough trouble just keeping your little band of hero guns together. Where, where, where did everyone go? Bounty on the way you at, buddy. Oh! I'm literally so happy to see you again. You have no idea. I was for real freaking out. Oh my god, you found me. I was freaking out. I, I was worried. I was worried I'd lost you. There's my buddy. There we are. I was on the fence for a minute there, but deep down I knew you wouldn't leave me behind. About time. How'd you even manage without me, huh? Another blank void. How the hell do we get out of this? I... Kenny, 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 what is it now? I... I don't know. Oh, Kenny. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry I let everyone down. I, I was selfish and stupid, and I beat myself up for it every single day, and I'm so glad I found all of you because you've given me reason to live again. Oh, Kenny. Well, 
Don't get all mushy about it. I just, I just, I just want to make things right. You can. We all can. Well, to be honest, I'd given up on everything before you guys came along. Before I found all of you. But now we're a team. And we're unstoppable. God damn it. He's right. You, you mean, you mean it? Yeah, dumbass. We've all made mistakes. I mean, not Kenny-level planet-wide genocide mistakes, but we've all made mistakes. And there is no way we're letting your big, big fucking mistake keep us from taking down the G3. So let's kick some fucking ass together. Yeah, that sounds good. Everything they just said sounded really good and smart. I love you all so much. You're the first real family I've ever had. Except for my little kids I spawned and shoot at bad guys. And the family I probably had before the G3 fucked with my brain and ruined all my memories. Let's do this, bounty hunter, as a family! Thanks, everyone. Let's fucking do this. All right, that's it. I'm gonna erase all your game data now. I can do that, it's easy. You'll have to start all over. Here we go. You ready? Okay, did that work? No? Shit, you're still here? I don't actually know how to do that. Never mind, forget this. What are you doing? You're supposed to be spiraling into darkness. Not for me, stronger. This shouldn't be happening. I don't do it for real dark shit. Most people can't handle it. Stop my back. Okay, we're back. I think we're back. That was a lot. Is, is everyone okay? It, it looks like we really killed him, at least. He's, he's dead. I'm doing it, Kenny. I feel bad. And, I, and I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, me too. I love you guys. Okay, the Earth coordinate should be logged in here somewhere. Fuck yeah, Biatch, we got him! Whew. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm good. Let, let's let's cut a nipple off. Let's do it. Wrong wire. Wrong wire. Shit. Careful, you old bag of shit. You've already messed up everything else in your life. You don't want to mess this up, too. No, shut up. Like you'll want to talk after your little Winnebago honeymoon. Whoa, be, be, be careful with him. Real smooth, Gene. That's supposed to happen. I know. I meant that sincerely. I just don't know actually how to be nice to you. Gene almost killed your super gun all over again. Don't listen to her. I'm about to do some real Frankenstein shit here. Oh, God. I don't know if I'm going to be able to look him in the eye. <sighs> That's fine. I think we accidentally severed his optic nerves earlier. What are you staring at, dork? Oh, yeah, right. Me and Gene, best buds. We had a real bonding moment a little while ago when I was helping him stuff a bag of dicks down his throat. Yeah, dream on, kid. I hope your sister gets space chlamydia. Wow, yeah, no, they're, they're getting along. All right, almost got it. Stand back, everyone. Here we go. Is he? Wait for it. Let's do it. Les, is that, is that you? Let's do it. Oh. I might have fucked up his speech centers, too. Let's do it! Let's do it! Talk to me! Let's do it! So what, all he can say is his name? This is sad. Listen, everything else I did was perfect. He can shoot, he can think, he can shit, he just can't talk right. But he's all in there, right? Like, he knows who I am? 
Let's do it. Les, I, I can't. Let's do it. I'm so sorry. I, Let's do it. I, I can't believe I didn't have to tell everybody what I did. Are you kidding, are you kidding me right now? Fuck off, Kenny. Kenny. Fuck off. What? What? I, and I'm happy to see my friend, okay? Fuck. See, I'm not the worst scumbag here. Wow, this is really it, huh? Let's do it! You got the earth coordinates, right? It's time for your final mission. Whatever. I need it instantaneous. And I know we have the tech for that. Why are you still delivering pizzas by foot? Just zap them to me. There's like 10 different ways you can do it by now. Portal door, warp base, anything. I don't care. Just get it to me right now. Wait. Never mind. I'm not hungry. Bye. What's in there? Traveler, welcome to Mr. Keeps. <laughs> Portaling your item to the baggage area now. Thanks. God, I hate giving this stuff up. I hate to part with that. Hey, uh, you've been making quite a name for yourself. Everybody, everybody thanks for your business. Don't buy anything else. Enjoy. I think you'll be happy with that. Wow, you bought something. I'm so impressed. Ugh. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> this might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? All right, then. You're gonna need Les Do It. All right, Les Do It. We got this. Let's do it. Let's walk this house back to Earth. Let's do it. Okay, dude, we get it. Let's do it. Here. I'm too scared to look outside. Hey, kid, before you go, come talk to me. I've got one last thing. Once you step out of the house, we're gonna warp away to safety until the deed is done. That means you'll be on your own. No, not alone. The power of Gatlas will be on uh, at our side. Yeah, no shit. We know that. I'm just... Uh, God, it was just a figure of speech, Kenny. Look, Armantuous is tough. You might not be able to beat him even with Lesdoit. 
So, if push comes to shove, use this. What is it? A remote atomizer bomb. Intel says Garmantuas has thick skin like armor, but if you can get this inside him somehow, then trigger it remotely? Well, let's just say his guts should still be easy to fuck up. This'll blow him up for good. Y you really think we're gonna need that? I don't know. Just don't want you to die. You're happy now? Happy that you forced me to admit I give a shit? Just take it. This thing was hard as hell to find. Thanks, Gene. You know, we, we, we care about you too. Okay, cool. Fuck off. Good luck. You got this. Good luck. Don't you dare fucking die on me. We'll be waiting to celebrate with you when you're- Holy shit, this is- This is awful! But, but there's still time to save your people! Let's do it! Yes, exactly! Holy shit, that's the best thing I remember! God damn, he's a real powerhouse! Good thing we got him fixed up, huh? Oh, fuck, he's drunk! I'm glad he's on our side! Wow, let's do it! You're so powerful! Let's it's do it! It's really impressive! Is everyone else seeing this? You guys gotta see this! Now you know what it was like for us, I guess. 
back to the grind. Okay, how's everyone feeling? We're, we're almost there. D d d there's no time for feelings. Let's just focus on killing Gamantuas. Yeah, not the time for chit-chat, Kenny. Oh, come on, you're not still- Mad at you? Look, it's complicated. I'm kinda mad still, yeah. Yes, it's complicated. We all love you, Kenny! It's, 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 it's complicated! Like I said the first time, it's complicated! Well, we had that powerful shared drug experience together, and we, we, we learned so much about ourselves and, and working together. Look, and Kenny, we, we, there's a lot of shit to work through here. We're not gonna solve it in one drug trip. Maybe we did, though. You know we're here with you, Kenny. You're, you're, you're practically family, and, and we mostly only have each other. But it's not that easy. Yeah, so let's just kill Garmantuas and see where things go from there. We'll completely forgive you after we kill Garmantuas, Kenny. Preacher, that's not true. But it's not... Not true. Okay, I, I get it. Let, let, let's just do this. Let's do it. And I'm here too. Knifey, your friend. Remember me? Ready to go. Another Sweezy fan. You know, she is really popular with, huh? Uh, uh, I mean, let's do it. Okay, give it to me straight, guys. Do you really think we can beat Garmantuous? With let's do it? Yes. Big time. He fucks shit up. We're unstoppable. Yeah, I guess. We can do this, Kenny! Creature's right. We can! We can do this! I hope so. I just don't... I don't want to let everybody down again. You got a problem with us? <laughs> Not bad, huh? Oh, Gus still got it! How's it going? No problem. I'm just glad I could help too. Yeah, I'm still pretty handy, huh? Shit, this is it. It's him. Okay, deep, a little deeper. There we go. Okay, yeah, shove that bomb all the way up his asshole into his intel or whatever's up there. Okay, that should be good. Now pull out and let's blow this fucker up. It's time for the G3 to become the G0. Suck my ass. Okay, what's wrong? Is, 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 is it broken? God damn it, Gene, the remote's busted. Oh, shit. Oh, hello. You're fucking done. Now it's time to make you really suffer. Let's make a deal. If you give up and turn yourself over to me, then I won't harm the two people you love most in this world. Fuck, he's got your parents. Behold! Uh, hey, it's me, Jack Black. Hi, I'm Susan Sarandon. D do we know you? Huh? Uh, are those your parents? Parents? What, what the fuck are you talking about? I don't think the bounty hunter even knows these people. Yeah, we don't. But it's so nice to meet you. So what? You don't love these two? Because every human I asked said they loved them. Well, yeah, everyone loves us. I'm sorry, Bounty Hunter. I'm sure your parents are still out there somewhere, you know? They're alive. I, I, I can feel it. <laughs> okay, Bounty Hunter. Enough fucking around. Let's finish this. Good delusion of if you're going to stop me. Ha, 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 ha. 
I know a way to detonate it. I knew you'd figure it out, Kenny. I'll go inside of his asshole, and I'll detonate it manually. Oh, that's not good. Kenny, that would mean... Yeah, I know. Kenny, we're not letting you do that, okay? There's gotta be another way. Can you think of anything? Actually, no. I can't. I guess this is the only way. You're gonna blow both yourselves up? Kenny, you might die. I... I know. Hey, bounty hunter, fighting alongside you has been... Well, it's been the best thing that's ever happened to me. Thank you for giving me the adventure of a lifetime. Now shove me deep inside that monster slug's dirty asshole. Kenny! I want to do this. I, I need to do this. Let's do it. Whoa, whoa, no, no, no. You, you should not sacrifice. Let's do it. We, we just brought him back to life. It's not fair. Let's do it. God, it was a huge sacrifice, but we did it. Oh, 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 shit, it's done. Come out to us, it's dead. He's fucking dead. Rest in peace, fucker. Good work, bounty hunter. What about... Do, do you think they... There's no way they could have survived that. What a noble sacrifice. Oh, my God, they, they, they're alive. I can't believe it. Oh, my God, they survived. They made it. No fucking way. Do, do we did it. I'm so glad you're okay. And then maybe we can have a sequel with you, with us, you know, all of us, because you're alive still, you know, and then you'd be there for, like, any DLC or a sequel. We owe you big time. The whole universe owes you. Now you're a fucking hero. I'm so glad you made it. We did it. Holy shit, kid. You really did it. Gamantuous is dead. Well, uh, just so you know... Everything's kind of just gonna be the same for a bit. News takes a while to travel. There's still gonna be G3 guys to fight everywhere. But, uh, good job! <laughs> Seriously. We have with us today the star of the new film Turtle Fuckers, uh, Jake Turtlefuckers. I guess, uh, now that you've saved the galaxy, I should probably remove the self-destruct trigger I installed in your suit. It was a fail-safe in case you didn't die, but now I like you, so I'd be sad if you died. And I'm also legitimately scared of you. How do you feel about all that? I mean, honestly, for me, I mostly just was excited to fuck the turtles. You still can't believe you really pulled it off. I hope that doesn't sound rude. I mean, you get it, right? It was a real long shot. You really didn't seem like hero material when we first met. Oh, no. You're gonna tell people I helped you, right? You gotta make sure people know I was part of this. I mean, if, if you want to. It's, it's not my place to convince you to do the right thing and not throw your closest ally under the bus. Jake is part of the religion where he believes that when you die, you pass on and you uh, go to the realm of pixie dust and fairy lands where everything's happy and nice and you can fuck all the turtles you want. It's a religious thing! You know, it sounds like it's a really the best of all worlds for him now that he's dead and he gets Hold to... Hold on, I gotta, I gotta go. I, I'll see you later. Jesus Christ, don't let screaming guys into the set anymore. Hey there, human fans. I'm Humandor the Human, and today we're watching another ultra-scary human flick straight from the freshly discovered planet Earth. This one's called Vampire Hookers. We have both vampires and hookers here in space, so I think I know what to expect. What's that? You don't know what humans are? Well, they are brand new species we just discovered. They're a bit like squeeglops, and they have the same type of butts as cliggets. But get this, humans don't have a dwingus anywhere on their bodies. If that shocks you, then watch out. Vampire Hookers is full of even bigger scares. Let's get this show on the road. 
Actually, here in space, we call them vampire sex workers, but I guess humans are behind the times. Hello? Who's there? Are you trying to prank call me? Okay. Good work. You got me. I don't give a shit. You think I care about getting pranked? Okay, fuck you! I've got powerful friends. I know a really strong bounty hunter, and I'm gonna send him to kick your ass! How do you like that, huh? Hello? Who is this? If this is Nancy from the City Comptroller, I actually would like to speak to you. Is this Nancy? Well, I'll tell you what, if it is or isn't, maybe you could pass on the message to Nancy because I'm not sure if you're aware, but on my block on 67 Rosebud, well, the Rosebud Avenue between uh, Terrace uh, Court and uh, Jarvis Street, in that, in that area, I have a pool in the back of my yard. It's a saltwater pool, and the neighborhood boys, they come around on their fucking BMX bikes, and they, they ride all over my, my, my rose garden, but that's not the, where it ends, is they take the little rocks and the little pieces of fertilizer and soil from my garden, and they throw it into my fucking pool, and all those goddamn little rocks, they get into the filter, and I gotta change that thing out every single time they do it. And those filters are about $700. So, I don't know if that's part of your jurisdiction, but maybe could you get somebody out here to figure that fucking shit out, otherwise I'm gonna have to take matters into my own hands. And I've killed before. Now, legally, it was under, uh, it was in war. I have been, I have served, but I know what it's like to take a life. And I will do it to the children, or at least their fucking parents, because I'm out $1,400, and if you can't do the math, Nancy, that's two fucking filters. So if you'd get back to me as soon as you can, or, or, or I guess if you can pass this on to Nancy, just let me know and I'll figure it out. And if it's one of your little shits crank calling me, I'm gonna take matters into my own hands. You just wait. Nice moves! Bet you're looking for Globo, huh? You, you bet you want to hear him drum, don't you? Yeah, well, where is he? We'll try to wrap your head around this. He got signed to Blobbity Bloop's Records, and he landed a big gig on a late night TV show here, and this could be his big break. And it's all because of you. We all knew he was going to be a big star, and you took the time, and goddammit, Oh, we're just so excited. Thank you so much. Holy shit, that's amazing! Oh my god, I, I'm so glad that we could be part of, like, you know, music history. You know history. what? Fuck everybody who made fun of him for farting out of his face. Globo's gonna be huge. I mean, this is a... You're, you're looking at the next, uh, 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 uh D Davey Wilson. Globo's got the sweetest heart. I, I'm so glad everyone's gonna finally get to hear what he's got on the inside. And not just the disgusting wet fart sounds he makes. Bounty Hunter, you look hungry. Let me help you out. Hey, how you doing? Oh, I like where your head's at. Sure thing. I hope you enjoy your food. Okay, I'm not so good at this. I'm not having a good time. This is a bad episode. This one's really fucking going down the drain. Yeah, great call, great phone call. Ring, 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 ring. Hey. Jimmy, Jimmy Goofster. Oh, power slide. Okay. Let's give it to me. Six feet, please. Pete, I'm gonna put me on palette pal pal and put, in, put everything in the in the in the in my palette of palettes. I wanna stop everything. 
you know, that's happening. Uh, for you, I don't care about me, I'm for you, I'm Babel B. A movie starting. You know, we deserve a break. L let's watch. L let's sit down and watch. It's starting. So, guys, what are we watching today? I don't know. It's just a black screen right now. Oh. But I'm, I'm very, uh, very anxious. What does it say, Rich? It says... Demon wind. Demon wind. Oh, I can hear wind. That's the demon wind. Are you sure it's not an unrelated wind? Oh my goodness gracious. Uh, my grandfather went the exact same way. Oh, they got burnt down across in 1931. It was a lot more common back then, right? Uh, I don't know. All those lawn <laughs> crucifixions. <laughs> I've seen this, oh, this film movie before. we haven't watched? I, I've seen the film before, uh, 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 14 different times. Oh my god, you've seen Demon Wind 14 times. Yes, and you guys have So not. this has to be really good, then. Well, I no, can't wait. I, I've watched it 14 times so I can figure out what the fuck's going on. I'm sorry, what was that? I wasn't listening. Having a fireplace made out of cardboard and paper doesn't seem like the best idea. Jesus was always my favorite family member. So what relation is Jesus? That's our Uncle Jesus. <laughs> Great Uncle Jesus. Jesus, it, ironically, all of his photos are in color. But all the people born in 1931, all their photos are in black and white. I don't know how they achieved this technological <laughs> achievement marvel. Would it hurt you to smile, Grandma? You're in demon wind. Your career is going places. Uncle Jesus, the college years. Oh, it's my favorite song, Washed in the Blood of the Lamb by Styx. That's what you got? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so they like their candles, I guess. Uh, their wicker baskets. They love the Jesus. The, the Jesus protects the house, when, it, except for the fact that he doesn't protect the house. Candles, glass jars, religious photos, wicker baskets. Oh, now I know where my thrift store got all of its merchandise. That's what you got? Yeah, this is the worst Thanksgiving ever. No one showed up. The one guy that did show up, they burned on a cross. Help me, Jesus, I'm watching Demon Wind. 
it's kind of funny they, they, they've got all this religious picture, all these religious pictures, you know. They have all these pictures of Jesus, but they never once like mentioned Jesus in any of their spells. It's not religious, you know. Towards the end, Jay. We've well, seen he's, you've seen this movie. I've before? seen this movie before. Rich oh, and Jay. So you paid to see it again in a theater, huh? Well, I did. That's. Well, that means it's got to be good, right? I, I, I'm assuming so. Yeah, we'll find out. money on the Jesus pictures. Oh. Those boards are nailed to the door. That literally does nothing. You know what I mean? <laughs> do, do you know what I'm saying, Rich? I know what you're saying. They're just nailed to the door. They're not, they're not keeping the... Oh. <laughs> G3 have. Holy 
shit, is that, is that some sort of miniature town? Oh, hello there. <laughs> I'm Cutie Hubie, and it's my great pleasure to introduce you to Little Cutie Town. <laughs> We're a nice... Oh, fantastic. You've decided to take a look around Little Cutie Town. Oh, I'm so excited for you to see everything Little Cutie Town has to offer. Myself, I guarantee it. As soon as you walk away, I'm gonna be so depressed I just pop a gun in my own head and I die. I'm just gonna fucking die. How's that sound? No more living for me. I don't wanna be alive. My whole old town and home is gone and dead. And you did it. It's your fault. I know I invited you in, but you should have realized you're so big. You're gonna ruin things. You should have told me. I didn't think about it. I'm kind of dumb sometimes. But you're you're not as dumb as me. I I assume so. You should have said, hey, I'm not gonna go in there. I don't wanna stomp on shit like a big Godzilla. Not for me. Not my, not what I want to do with my life. I don't want to go kill everybody. That's what you should have said. Instead, you just did it. You walked in and you knocked over entire buildings. Everyone's dead now. I am I am so sad. I'm so fucking sad right now. I know that I, I mostly I'm just yelling. But if you if you let me just calm down for a second, which I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna calm down right now. I am so fucking sad. I'm so fucking depressed now. Do you have a, can, just shoot me, shoot me with your gun. Go ahead and shoot me so I die, so I don't have to kill myself. Just do me that favor. Just take me out of my misery. I don't wanna be, I don't wanna be alive if everyone else I know is dead. This is survivor's guilt. You ever hear that when someone- Whoa, Jesus. I wasn't sure if you were gonna actually kill him. Poor guy. You know, maybe it was the right thing to do. 